Hello you bonkers and welcome back today to another episode of AFL Evolution. We're back after two losses, five on the trot. The series is going great, don't you worry. And yes, we're back on AFL Evolution with terrible news. Adam Chera has been injured, but it's alright because Andrew Brayshaw is back from injury. We're swapping a young gun for another young gun, so we should be alright. Five losses on the trot, very good. We got the dogs in the first game of the ep. Let's go! Here we go, we got the dogs again because I simulated like five rounds and we just had them a couple episodes ago. But yeah, Adam Chera is out for eight weeks. A new addition to the side, Caleb Sarong is in. At the bounce of the ball, be strong and stand tall. We gave him the schlop and chop last time. Let's hope we can do it again. Brayshaw's back in the side. And he sees the tip rat making a big lead there. Can the rat grab it? He does. Tip rat finds Walters. Oh, look at this footy. This is absolutely marvellous. Kick a goal and that's the sequence of events that will be remembered for millennia. Get up, get up. Tip rat early. Tip rat early wants the goal. Far out, he sucks. Good fist from Frederick Akers. From the impossible angle. Ooh. That was close to being a very good goal. Oh, they're don't arguing like a bloody mum who's sick of having arguments with her children. Oh, Ethan Woods taking a ride on Caleb Sarong's shoulders. Got to get it down. We do. Clear. Good. Walters. Oh, Caleb Sarong takes the pack mark and sees the tip right. Tip can take here and go. And he does, he takes on his man. Can he find Walters? Walters, Schmolters, Bolters. High tackle, you dirty prick. And uh, we're gonna have a shot. Surely this goes through the big sticks, please. I am lagging again. Okay, this needs to be sorted out. Oh, fighting with a huge bump. And Tabner gives away a high tackle to the crab. That quarter is not a good display of football. To my defense, I was, I did have that uh, a technical issue that was making me have delay. But we'll come back this quarter and we'll show them who the bosses are. That's more like it. Brayshaw with the tackling pressure. The rat comes through. Oh, he'll go all the way here. He has to kick that. The rat kicks the first of the game. Lovely work from Andrew Brayshaw. Tackling pressure galore. Brayshaw's bumped off the ball. Five gets given the stiff arm. Ryan gets it down. Oh, no, they, they might be through here. Hit the post. Ooh. There we go. We've worked it well there. Here's Fife. Fife's out. Who's that? Brennan Cox. Brennan Cox, can he find Hogan? End to end. Oh, that would have been beautiful. It might still be beautiful if Matera can kick a Galazzo. We go. Galazzo. Brayshaw finds Tip Rat. Tippy, go! No, Hogan! Hogan still got that sabotage in him for the Tip Rat. No, that was a clear goal. Why'd you do that? But I went the ball! Blake Akers will have a shot. And if I'm not lagging, this should go through the big six. And it will. I told ya. Technical issues. Hogan, don't hit it. Let it go through. Yes! Needed that. Goal number three for the quarter. I told you I'd ramp up. Here's Majira. Get in there. Mundy finds Cox, who finds Hogan. Hogan is chucking on your boot. Come on, we're coming away for once. Pulling away. Not making this game a 50 50 up. We need a blowout. It's about time. Frederick gets rid of it. Cox takes flight here, I reckon. Oh, Coxie. Naughty boy. That would have been Phil Fife get up as well. End of the quarter. That's a good quarter. That's all we've been needing all series. We haven't been able to pull away from any team. 25 points up. Good quarter from the boys. Bruce with a big mark there, and the dogs are looking to go forward. But Hamling's back. The former dog. The former dog knows how to be a dog. Oh, when Alex Pierce puts his hands into Aaron Norton's back, should have taken him around the neck instead. And here he goes from bullshit angle, from bullshit range. Anyone but Aaron Norton. I reckon you can get there Monday, even though it's a Tuesday, it's actually a Wednesday. And Monday can burn, take a bounce, get rid of it. That's absolute class, Michael David Monday. And Frederick is lining up for his first in the last few games. Come on, Fredo, Freddy, Freddy Frog, Fredo Frog kicked it, the Frogmeister. Ah, get it, no, tackle him, tackle him with the, with the tackle. 
Nathan Wilson. Nathan Wilson. Good mark from Banfield there. Finds Walters. Walters is taking this up the guts. He wants goal of the year. Just like Walters, but he won't be selfish. He gives it to Darty, who settles, kicks, and shanks it. That's why he was dropped last week. <laughs> Come on, Darty. Pull your head in. You're not a model for Street X. You're a footballer. Rory Lobb again! Two weeks in a row. Rory Lobb has taken an absolute specky Jazzalenko. The specky king these days is the lobster. Put it through. Put it through. Pull away. Pull away. Come on. Oh, his mark is on the line. You're kidding. Oh, he's just gone. Bang on the left peg. Josh Shacky. Shack, the Shackinator. End of the quarter there. Dockers up by 18. The dogs actually made a bit of ground in that quarter. But as long as we can keep our distance, we can cruise home to victory for once. Hayden Crozier, the former Docker in the middle here. Oh, he definitely learned that kick at Dockers HQ. Finds Jack McRae. Kick the goal if Donald Trump is a good person. Yeah, he knows what he's doing. Here's Bruce. Good smother by Blakely. Good bump by Banfield. Good tackle by Fife. But they come out the dogs. Hamlin gets it down only to Josh Bruce. And they've kicked it. They're coming back every time this bloody happens. We need a win. We've lost five on the trot. It's only a two kick game. We were in this position against Melbourne and we absolutely cooked it. We can't do that again. We can't afford another loss. We will be out of finals contention. Lift boy. Kick a goal if the riots are unjust. Get there, Cam. Cam helps brings it to ground, but the dogs are right back in the mix, in the blender. And a huge pack up by Billy Gowers. Kick a goal if black lives don't matter. You racist prick. God, look at this pack. Everyone's here, because this clearance is going to be vital. And Walters gets it. And Mundy's there. Can he grab it? That'll be a huge clunk. Dunkley takes it. The dunker. Get up, Alex. Good fist from Alex. Need a clearance. Need a clearance. We get a clearance. Bring it down. Caleb Sobrong. He's done well. The young fella. Big tackle. Big stoppage. Fight with a huge tackle. Rat, get in there. McCarthy clears. Rory Lobb, take that. Another huge mark from Rory Lobb. We'll take our time. And Rory Lobb will kick a goal, hopefully. Oh, no. Oh, no. Get up, Tabs. Tiprat, get that ball. Surely, tackle. 15, 10. That has to be game. Yes, we've done it, lads. Didn't need to be that hard again. We always let the other team come back into it. First win in six games. We needed that. Stay tuned for the second game of the episode. We've only got the bloody Eagles in this episode. I didn't even know. I would have prepared better. Big game, up ahead. The tip rap wasn't prepared. I would have, I would have given him a neck massage heading into this episode if I hadn't known. But we've got the Eagles, huge. They're 11th, we're sixth. Let's get into the game. Western Derby, Dockers home ground advantage. Here we go, biggest game of the season. Yet, we need a win. We need to secure our sporting finals with five games left in the season. Come on boys, huge game. We take drugs and we are feral. Our fans are entitled and we are de-doids. We like to sniff coke and inject speed. We're the Eagles and we suck poo. Rory Lobb against Nick Nat. Easy money for you, Lobb. Here we go, the first bounce of the derby. Nick Nat wins it and they get the clearance. That's not a good start. And Willy, Willy Billy Rioli takes it. Wheels on there off the world. Stop the Eagles. Nah. Brandon Archie. More like Brandon's going to say, Archie, do a sneeze and miss this goal. Told ya. Too predictable with these eagle dogs. Get there, young Tiprat against his old side. Wheels, burns, kicks a goal. The first of the derby. That would have won a few multis. I bet he would have been the favourite. Go on, Tiprat. Against his old side, he always shows up. Here he goes. He's quick, but that no, he's chasing. That no, he doesn't want it. Wilson finds Frederick. Who finds Walters? Matera. Get up, son. Light breeze, light work, I say. That's my motto. Anyway, here's Matera. 
Ooh. Is the rat versus that Nui in the rock again? Oh, it's the wrong! Oh, Walters, kick that. Yes! Come on! Take that, wankers! Specky just letting go, you beauty! Oh, I've only gone and specking my own mate. There's Liam Ryan. Ah, oh, no, he's kicked that right through the eye, diddle diddle. Doc is ahead by five. Not comfortable enough. The Eagles actually did have a bit of control there. We did well to capitalise on our chances, but we need to have more chances. More time on the ball. Oh, good bump from the Moose. The Moose finds five. Five finds Tim Rat. TP number 69, baby. Oh. Wait, what? What happened there then? Oh, I didn't even score because Jesse Hogan bloody sabotaged it. Grab that right. Yeah. Kicking practice. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, okay, 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 I'll take it, I'll take it. Not the cleanest release, but I'll take it. Doc is up by two bloody goals. Get it out, boys. We don't like it in here. Uh-oh. Tackle, 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 Gina Malobis. And they've kicked it. Jack, darling, you're not a darling. You're a creep. Look at you. There's Fife. Fife gets done ball by Nat Nui. God, that is iconic. Oh, and they found the man here, Jackson Nelson. Choose a name. Is it Jackson or is it Nelson? It doesn't matter. You're probably an inbred eagle anyway. Kick a goal if you abuse women. And that doesn't surprise me because he plays for the West Coast Eagles. They've come back and they're actually ahead. Bloody hell. Oh, they are mounting here, the West Coast Eagles. Oh, Kennedy. Kennedy, Kennedy, Kennedy. Oh, they are mounting. Get that handling. Get under it. Oh, we keep bringing it down and they've got cropping little rats every time. Why is Walters playing in defense? And they've done it again, the dirty crumbing rats. Thank God he's missed that. Why is Walters in defense? Why are they keep crumbing everything? They keep bringing it to ground and we can't do anything about it. West Coast took over that quarter. We were up by five. They've kicked bloody four goals in that quarter, I reckon. Shocking stuff. Oh, I didn't kick it there. Wicked Witch. Wicked Witch is going to cost me the derby. I didn't kick it there, Wicked Witch! Uh-oh, we can't lose to West Coast. No way, Jose Mourinho. Kick a goal if you abuse women. Oh, they, it doesn't work on the Eagles, because they do. Pierce gets rid of it to him on Monday. Take that. His fight finds the rat to get back in it. The rat kicks it. We need a goal there, Tim. Walters come through. Finds the wrong for his first goal in footy. No! Walters, yes, thank you. Walters never lets you down. That's what you've got to realise as a Dockers fan. Consistent, perfect, never misses a shot. Focus, otherwise you're going to lose to the Eagles on your channel. You're going to have to edit this video, and it's going to be so embarrassing, like how you get it done holding the ball. Get up, Brat, we need you here. More than ever, we need you, Tip Brat, to stand up and show everyone the man you really are. Please sail through for all the love that's holy. Tim Brad is lifting again. Need it. Tim Brad does well. Gets it out. Brayshaw finds McCarthy. Settles. Kicks. He can't kick the ball straight. He can't mark it. Cam McCarthy is getting dropped next week. End off. Good, Freddy. Walters, make a lead. Oh, just kick it right, right to you. Right there. Might have to go to the barrel. Barrel is locked. And loaded. I don't think that's going to be straight enough though. It's probably going to hit the post unless the wrong can get under it. He's kicked it. Yes. That's a great goal. We needed it. We're coming back into it. Here's Walters. Walters will never let you down. Walters will never give you up. He will never roll around or desert you. Oh. It's a decent quarter. Huge final quarter that can defy our season. We can't lose to this mob. Look at them, the bunch of inbreds. Last quarters don't get much bigger than this. We need a goal still, boys. We need a couple. Bullshit. No. No. Miss it if you... No. This isn't looking good, boys. This isn't looking good. Get in there, Mundy. Go! Find the rat! The rat's there! Go, rat! Burn him! 
No! No! That was our best opportunity. Get it, get it, get it. We didn't even score in the last quarter there. Another episode of AFL Evolution ends in heartbreak. That was an absolute war. Tip Rat, man of the match, but it wasn't enough. Why does it always have to be a war? Why can't we pull through? But if you did enjoy the episode, thank you for watching. Recommend me to a friend. Drop a like, drop a sub. Go follow my socials in the description. Thanks for watching. See you later.